Today I'm going to start a little different project. Uh, it's still for the workshop, but not so much woodworking. Um, I've got my dad's old craftsman tool chest here. And I'm looking forward to having lots of drawer space in the shop. Uh, I really have no drawers right now, so uh, this is going to come in real handy. It is very dirty. It's got a lot of oil and grease on it and dust. So I'm going to take a cleaner degreaser and really scrub it down and clean it up. And uh, hopefully it will look good just like that. Uh, if not, I might decide to repaint it. So uh, stick around. All right, guys, you got to check this out. I ended up painting the tool chest, and I painted it Van Halen style. Uh, it turned out really good, and I'm going to show you the whole process I went through from start to finish in fast motion. And tonight, I thought I would dust off my guitar gear. Uh, normally, I'm a drummer in my band, but I did used to play guitar. So I'm going to see if I can remember any of those old Van Halen riffs from back in the day. Uh, so keep in mind, I'm a drummer. Uh, so if you hear some mistakes, you're going to have to forgive me. So, uh, let's get started. <laughs> spray nozzle, uh, I guess over time has fatigued the muscles. So I ran out to Home Depot and I bought this Rust-Oleum spray grip. So I'm going to try that and see if that helps. It's got a trigger on it and it looks like it just snaps onto the can. So let's we'll see how this works. Oh yeah, pretty cool. So I'm going to try this out, and this will be like a quick review of this uh, spray gun thing. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is worse than watching paint dry. job at keeping the tools still inside the drawer. Uh, as you can see when I move it back and forth pretty fast, the tools don't even move. 